back to my YouTube channel. This is my mom. Hi, everybody. I would say her name, but a hurricane might get started, so I'm not even gonna bother that. But um, today I'm gonna tell you five things about myself, five facts, and she's here to make sure you know that I'm telling you the truth. So, so the first fact about me is I'm a queen. I am a woman, and I'm also a big girl. So. What other word fits it? I'm a queen. So the way I'm a woman is because I'm independent. I can do a lot of things on my own. But I am a big girl and I'm very dependent on my mother. Like she helps me out with a lot of things. And I also have a tattoo on my thigh. I am a queen. So fact number two, I'm an optimist. I always like to view things in the best way possible because life is so short. So why dwell on something and make it and focus on the negative, we don't have to focus on the negative. You can focus on the positive thing of it. Fact number three about me, three about me, but um, fact number three about me is I am very, 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 very passionate about things I believe in. So if I, my mind is set on something and that's what I believe, nobody can tell me otherwise. Y'all, she is so truly passionate, even from when she was like one. If I told her not to do something, but she felt she should, she was gonna do it whether it came with a whooping or not. And then continue to explain her reason why she was getting a whooping, even though I'm saying, just be quiet, leave the situation alone. But she wouldn't, she has to get it out. Fact number four about myself, um, it's probably the worst fact about myself, but it's true so i really hate when others treat me like i treat them so for example if somebody is staring at me i don't like when people stare but i have a staring problem i will stare at you forever and not even knowing i'm staring at you but i'll get mad at someone for doing that to me fact number five about me is that i don't feel sorry for anyone um I really feel like God gives you the life that he's given you to make you into the person that he wants you to be. So I don't really feel sorry. I, the only times I feel sorry for someone is like if it's a small child and they're like getting abused or something and they really can't do much about it. But other than that, if you're grown and you're going through something, I feel like God has blessed you with many things, many opportunities to be able to overcome your situation or just keep faith in him and he'll get you through it. I mean, I'm not saying I'm not a supporter. I'll support you. I'll pray for you. I just won't feel sorry for you. That's all. But I just want to thank you guys so much for taking the time out to watch my video. Thank you for watching my baby's video. Yes. And, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what y'all want to see because I'll do pretty much whatever on this channel. Because it's my channel. I can do whatever I want. Yep. Bye.